Hello and welcome. In this video, we are going to learn how to use FTP adapter in Oracle Integration Cloud. Right now, I am in Oracle documentation for FTP adapter. The link I will give in the description. Kindly check out the link. Here, we can check the, what are the capabilities. This FTP adapter can connect to FTP as FTP servers, can encrypt or decrypt the file. This supports FTP as FTP as F, FTP over SSL connections. A bunch of details you can please check out this link. What are the FTP restrictions are there in this adapter right now? We can check out this link for that. Let us jump to how to create a connection. We are going to create a connection, then we are going to build an integration which will read FTP file from FTP server. Let me switch over to Oracle Integration Cloud instance. Go to connection. First of all, we have to create a connection. Search for FTP. Select. Give some meaningful name. I'm giving FTP learning con. Make it as trigger and invoke. I believe right now trigger is not allowed in FTP connection. We can invoke it. What are the prerequisites? Let me switch over to here. The prerequisites are you should be knowing the username, password, IP address or the port number. Or what is the source directory uh, from where the FTP server has to pull the file. Now we have to fill in the host address, port number, as FTP. As we are connecting to XFTP, I am giving S. I have to fill the username, password over here uh, if you are having ssl certificate password pgp key upload it over here as i'm trying to connect the F sftp server with the username password i'm giving filling up the details after filling all the details click on save click on test the connection as you can see our connection is 100 percent built let me go back click on save if you get the pop-up next job is we have to consume this integration and fetch the file what i'm trying to do is i have i'm trying to read the csv file that is first second third one two three four five six which is having three columns and three rows first is a header and two are the line records as you can see i have pushed the file to this location i have to copy this location and provide when I build the integration. Let me switch over to integrations. Create a scheduled integration. If you have the URL for documentation, provide it over here. Package details. Once done, click on create. Search for the connection which we have created. As it is showing it over here, click on FTP learning con. Click on next. If you are uh, cre uh, creating this FTP connection for B2B purpose, then you have to select this. As I'm not going for B2B, I'm keeping this default and clicking on next. What I'm trying to do is I'm trying to read the file. There are a bunch of options over here. Read the file, read the file, list the files. Reading the file will uh, try to read the file from the FTP server. Writing the file will try to create a file and uh, write the data into that a list the files is particularly like listing the it will create a list of files available in the directory move a file will move a file from a particular directory to uh, other directory delete a file will delete a file from the directory download a file i will cover the video on how to use this download file option and uh, process a file up to 1 gb in oracle integration cloud right now i'm going for a reader file there is a catch over here we can read a file only uh, up to a data of 10 mb okay input directory i'm giving it over here the example for file is star.csv star is basically anything which is uh, having dot csv extension it will read if you have a particular name pattern then we can give it over here click on next let me go back and select a ASCII. Here we can give. This is basically asking uh, do you have to specify a structure for the content? If no, we can give no and uh, read a file in a binary format and we can uh, transform that binary to a ASCII format and try to read the data. 
okay as i'm not going for this option i'm selecting is s um, okay uh, it is asking for to define a structure of the file content we can provide a sample csv file we can build a xsd or the native schema we can provide a sample xml single or a non space or uh, sample json document can be provided if you're trying to read a json file okay if you are going to read a flat file or a fixed delimited file we can give a native schema file over here as we are reading a csv file i'm giving a csv option over here click on next click on choose file and select the sample file we have selected our file sample file i'm giving this a record name this game has a record set i'm marking everything is optional but i don't want to mark the first column as optional i'm giving it as mandatory okay use clicking on this will consider the first row in the file as a header which i want if not if you don't unselect this it will consider all three rows in the file as line level records character set from here we can select the uh, file encoding format ours is utf8 i'm keeping it as default if you have another format like utf16 binary or any other format we can just select it over here and click on next and if you want to check the schema generated by OSC, as I was saying, this will generate a native schema behind the scene and try to read the file. Click on OK. If you want to override the details, what we have provided in while configuring this FTP in MOOC connection, then we can do it over here. Go to the mappers, expand this request, go to directories and provide the path over here and go to the file name as we are reading learn.csv we are providing the file name over here click on validate validate close the connection mapper if you get the error like count one error then go to tracking add the business identifier like what you have done click on save error will go off click on save close activate and run this integration enable tracing activate run this integration and get go to monitoring and check the audit logs as you can see our ftp learning integration instance is successful click on this i button and check the details as you can see we are reading two records on fun is one two three and four five six what we had in a file Thank you for watching this video. Please do like, comment and subscribe the channel.